What's going on good people? I just wanted to give you a quick update on the Glock 44 that I bought the other day. Um, I got it on, I guess it was the 6th, so after work I picked it up that evening. Um, as of this afternoon, Sunday the 9th, I have uh, a little over a thousand rounds through it. And I've had one malfunction. I had a stovepipe, which could be the gun, uh, no doubt about that. Um, but other than that, I haven't had any other issues. I haven't oiled it, I haven't cleaned it. I just took it straight out of the box and started loading it up with ammo. I'm not running any fancy high-tech stuff. I just have some uh, old American Eagle bulk stuff that I'm running through it. I know these uh, from just reports online can be kind of finicky as far as ammo selection is concerned. So the American Eagle, and I think this might be 40 grain, 38, excuse me, it's 38 grain. I um, haven't had any issues with that. Um, I have some other ammo that I'm going to eventually run through because I think I only have about uh, maybe 400 more rounds of that. So by the time I run through that, uh, I'll be off to the next one. We'll see if it's still uh, reliable with that. But so far, so good. Um, I know there's some other 22 pistols that are better than the uh, Glock 44, make no mistake. But for me, this was the best option because I shoot Glocks, so my shit hits the fan holster. My appendix carry holster, just my outside the waistband holster, and uh, all of my competition holsters, whether it be for IDPA or USPSA, which I prefer more, that they all fit uh, this gun. So that means I don't need to uh, buy more holsters for it because when I go to the range, I do almost everything from the holster. I rarely shoot by picking the gun uh, up off the table or start drills with the gun in my hand. So. Uh, most of my drills are done from the holster, so that matters. That means I don't have to buy a new holster. And then the same thing with the mag pouches, the magazines. Although they're 22, they're wide enough so they fit. They have the same profile as your regular Glock, uh, Glock mag for that. So if you're not familiar with the 44, the 44 has the same, pretty much the same dimensions as the Glock 19, which is considered the compact uh, size. And for me, you can see my hand just barely fits, right? So this is just as small as I can go and still be able to get uh, a full grip on the gun. Uh, the 26, which is the smaller model, um, is too small for my hand. So the 19 is as small as I can go and still comfortably be able to grip the pistol. So this is kind of a good option, especially now with 9mm being hard to find or really expensive. And although I do use a friend's press to reload, sometimes I just get bored and I don't feel like, uh, or lazy really, and I don't feel like driving 45 minutes to his house to reload. Um, so being able to shoot 22 is a bonus. Save on ammo. And then also uh, for newer shooters, so when I'm at the range with clients and they might be recoil sensitive because they're a new shooter or various other reasons, then having something in 22 can really assist with that. And then also with qualifying people for the concealed carry course, if they're struggling a little bit with whatever gun they have, sometimes people buy too much gun, uh, then there's always the option as well. Uh, take them on the 22 and have them qualify with that. So let me know if you have any questions. This thing is run pretty much flawlessly, one malfunction. I do hate the sights, of course, standard Glock sights, but I just took a Sharpie, blacked them out. I prefer a blacked out rear, and then I put some silver paint on the front side works well for me now i can really pick up that front side the front side jumps out because uh, it's really not worth paying the money to swap the sights on what is basically a practice gun and a loaner gun that i'll use for other people i'm not going to spend the money on that it's not worth it um, i'd rather buy ammo but either way so far so good only a thousand rounds in um, i'll update again maybe after the next thousand or maybe when i get to five thousand uh, but again if you have any questions just let me know